Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Smart and I'm your teacher and I'll be teaching a different question and answer in this question and answer series by class theta. So our today's question which we'll be discussing is to ensure that your client are tracking sales on each sales and purchase in QuickBooks, where should you consider adding a tax rate to QuickBooks Online? So select all that apply, we have some options here, product and service, classes, suppliers, expense account and none of above. So the answer of the question is to ensure that your client are tracking sales tax on each sales and purchase in QuickBooks Online you should consider adding a tax rate in following areas. So products and service, you may need to add a tax to a specific product and service or assign a tax rate to individual customers if they are subject to different tax rates. So classes, if you use the class tracking feature in QuickBook Online, you can assign tax rates to different classes for accurate tracking of sales tax. And uh, none of above, it, it is not accurate select the none of above as option one and two applicable for tracking sales tax in the QuickBooks Online. So the correct answer is product and service and classes. That's the correct answer. If you still need any other question, just leave a comment and I'll be back as soon as I can. Thank you very much for watching the video. Until next question. Bye.